as we look deeper and deeper and deeper with Hubble Space Telescope, we'd see fewer and fewer galaxies. We come to the end of what the Hubble can see. We just see darkness. It is not that we're running out of galaxies. It was the fact that as the universe is expanding and stretching across space and time, its light is being redshifted, and the galaxies from the very early universe are being shifted out of the view of the Hubble Space Telescope. The Hubble Telescope can only see what you can see with your eye, the wavelengths that your eye is sensitive to, plus a little bit of ultraviolet and a little bit of infrared. Those galaxies are so far away from us that as light travels through space, and space is expanding because the universe is expanding, the light gets redshifted. So it changes from blue light into red light as it travels through space. It's so far away from us and so far back in time, its light only reaches us via infrared wavelengths. And that's why we decided to build the James Webb Space Telescope, to penetrate beyond what Hubble could see. The Webb is going to give us infrared eyes. We will be able to write this final chapter in the history of galaxies. We will now see the first galaxies. We can see galaxies as they are today. And so this span of some 13.6 billion year history will be laid out before us for the first time.